This is a Sunday morning in Bomberg. Last night, Saturday night, the streets were packed. Everybody was out. They said that's normal for Saturday on Bamberg, even Fridays. But it is 11 o'clock, and as we always tell people, Germany is closed after 6 on Friday and closed all day Sunday. There's no way you get this in that way. That's all right, other than all the construction. But it is a very quiet Sunday. Just the little color variations in all the buildings and Cafe Osterreich. You'd think it was seven or eight in the morning, but it is almost noon. Yeah, the city's waking up a little here at noon. In a slightly more awake area, but it's really we d we saw this in the evening when the clouds and storms were coming in, and then we walked through it the next day when it was cloudy. So this is the first time we're really seeing it in the light, you know, in sunlight, and it makes it a very different experience in a lot of ways. But now we can catch the town, the Altusrat house, in the sunlight. And the river level, which clearly went up after the rainstorms the other day. The funny thing is, we have, we have walked every bridge in this town. <laughs> we really have. <laughs> is that the crane we saw blowing around the other night? There's a 
what they call Little Venice over there. Part of it. That's part of Little Venice over there. We saw it last night. But it, it is very cool and different to see Bomberg in the sunlight now. To see this part of Bomberg. Uh, Sorry, I want to take this in big time. I know we've seen it several times, but this is the first time seeing it in a blue sky with the sun. And oh, is that cool? <sighs> to think the river's going right under it or right around it. But yeah, you have to do it. Okay. What a nice little shop. Ah, there we go. Beauty with beauty. I said beauty with beauty. Just need a super wide angle camera. I'd love to get the whole thing in one shot. Kein Problem, kein Problem. and then I'll make the official Bamberg video out of the sunny shots we're doing. Yeah, I don't know that we need to go, I mean, it's up to you. I don't know if we need to go back to the residence in the cathedral. I mean, we have... What? You can add some of those. Pretty little park here. All right. New part of Bomberg we're discovering today.
No, go ahead. There's a lot of ponds in Bamberg, but half of them are not running. Pretty, and oh, these smell pretty too. This is the <laughs> Bamberger Courthouse. Not that you're getting a great view of it until I get past the trees. We're coming up to a... Take the second exit onto Wilhelmstrasse. View with this now. Yeah. That's cool. And this is the Leibniz Institute. So again, if we weren't desperate for toothpaste, we would not have seen this. <laughs> There's a view back towards town, and we live in that area over there. Huh. Yeah, you got some people boogie boarding and... Uh, So Joyce and I are heading up to the little monastery here, a Franciscan monastery, pretty little grounds it'll have. There you go. So one last morning in Bomberg. Mm -hmm. It's it's a nice city. I've enjoyed it. We have been at a slower pace, which maybe is not a great thing, but it's been good. It's okay. Yeah. It's good. We're yeah, hiking it's up good. to a... This could be another hot one, and I haven't gotten that much shorter. We're really on the slope. Yeah. Yeah. So, <laughs> there. We'll put Joyce in front. <laughs> now she's, she's right too on tall. on the camera, all right. There you go. <laughs> oh, we'll have to go portrait. There we are. There we are. <laughs> so, okay. All right. Yeah. So he's up there. We gotta go up a set of stairs, yeah. But you get sort of a view of part of the town. The university and I'll say, Bomberg makes you earn it. <laughs> A lot of steep climbs. There's the castle we were at a couple of days ago. Good meal, good beer. And 
one monastery that is under construction. So you're not allowed to go in. You can go up and walk around it. But we'll go to the gardens. I just think it looks cool with the cathedral in the background. So this, this is a monastery. It's a historical site, but it's an active monastery. Getting ready to open a couple of the ends here. A little bit of what's left of their gardens. Normally this whole thing would be gardens and grounds, but they tore up a lot of it for uh, construction. Yeah, let's turn it this way. It's all under construction. And so we can go back out that way. Do you want to go back out the way we came? Um, you weren't you weren't born into nobility, but you got raised to a level just below nobility. So a freiherr meant a free lord, a free man. So you weren't a knight, but you rose. You were like a patrician or somebody who worked his way up to a level that they. But yeah, we've been here once before. Oh, not exactly where I expected to come out, but I'll take it as a win. Absolutely take it as a win. The boat is selling tickets and loading up right there, baby. Uh, got down to the river here. And we want to take a boat ride right there. But this is called Little Venice. Uh, why didn't I discover this spot earlier? Swim trunks on. Okay, we can't go this way, so we have to go back up and around. Oh, well. Sorry, honey. But I found a little shortcut. And what I did was find a great photographic view and access to the river. Oh, there's little fish and such in there. Yeah. Can you see them? There's little fish in there. Oh, yeah. I've seen them. Like minnows, but... Yeah. Bunches of them. Hey, little guys. Sprechen Sie English? <laughs> Sie sprechen fish. Yeah. Something big just dove over here. Yeah. Hi, Joyce and I are on a boat right now. Yeah. Hopefully to enjoy this boat ride. Although Joyce may not make it. I can stand.
I don't want to sit here. I don't want to sit there. I don't want to, oh, gonna, oh, wait, if I sit here, I'm going to smell the fumes. <laughs> I don't want to sit going backwards. I don't want to sit east on a north facing ship. And I don't. <laughs> now she's Popeye. Yeah. All right, the one angle of the rod house we haven't been able to get until now. A few months ago, we were standing there at the river right there.
fünf Sterne Schiffe, so ein Schiff hat bis zu 50 Besatzung. Bevor uns jetzt der frühere Prinz Ludwig war, im Bau 1910, er wurde von beiden und tiefer gelegt, sodass jetzt der Schiffe bis 3000 Tonnen in den Hafen sind. Die Schlagsbetriebe werden 